Oh my gosh, you guys, look at the temperature. I am shook. Greetings, it's Salutations YouTube, it's Adrian here. Welcome to another episode of the vlog. How's everyone doing today? Hope you guys are all doing fantastic. I started the vlog a little bit late today. I admit, it's almost four o'clock. Um, the day has just escaped me. I just had so much stuff to do this morning and didn't get everything, didn't get it all done until right now and all that stuff is just boring, so. The fun starts now, <laughs> but it's four o'clock. I have a bunch of packages packaged up. That's gonna go out today. So today is what is today? Um, today, I know today is Friday, Friday June eighth. Today is Friday June eighth, and anything ordered up to today by four p.m. Pacific Standard Time has been mailed out. So check your Depop, check your emails. Um, all that stuff, all this stuff is going out to you guys right now. Um, but I also wanted to give you guys an update on the Valentino bag. So, after much cleaning and polishing last night, I think it looks pretty fantastic. I still haven't sewn up the blue strap. So, I have my, um, the strap for my other bag on here. So I'm using that so that the blue one doesn't fall off. But I don't know, I kind of look like, I kind of like the the double strap look. I don't know if that's just me, you know, a little bit is always a little bit more, which is a little bit more awesome for me, so. And then I have my little Balenciaga keychain on here. I think the yellow really pops against the blue. And the color scheme is totally giving away that it used to work at Best Buy. <laughs> so I'm loving it though. I love it, blue and yellow, bright colors. I'm feeling super bright, super excited, super happy. Today is Friday, and tomorrow is Saturday, and tomorrow we're gonna go thrifting, so I am super excited about that as well. So, I'm just like on a high right now. So right now, we're gonna go to the post office. After that, we're gonna go to the Goodwill, and then I think we might actually head out. Okay, let's see if I can grab this. Um, okay, so. Unfortunately, for some people, <laughs> I think I am going to end up keeping this little guy. Again, I'm pretty sure it's fake anyway. And I have just always wanted one of these, like, cute little Louis Vuitton planners. And this is, like, closer than I've ever been having one. <laughs> so, um, it, I would actually be so excited for a GM size. That would be the perfect size for what I would want. So, um, until I get one of those, I am definitely gonna think, I think I'm definitely gonna be holding on to this. But, I want to go to Hobby Lobby, because I wanna get, I know they sell little inserts, so I think, I have this with me, I'm going to go over there and see if I can get a little insert for this. I just want a little calendar insert, because right now this is just like an address book, and that's what my phone's for. And I know you can use like, your, your calendar for, um, like calendar stuff as well but there's something about writing down your schedule that just makes it so much more exciting like writing down cell phone numbers and stuff like that that's kind of like eh I mean I honestly probably would do that if I had like a fancy like phone book but I actually do have a fancy phone book that I've written phone numbers down so like, <laughs> I already have one of those, but yeah, so I want to find a calendar insert for this, and we're going to go to Hobby Lobby to see if we can get one, and I also um, wanted to see if I can get, I'm like totally out of thank you cards right now, so unfortunately, I'm really sad to say that I didn't get to send like thank you cards with your orders that have gone out the past few days, and for that I apologize profusely, but I also came to notice that it saves a lot of time not like really like I know like it's so nice like writing them but like I'm definitely gonna get more thank you cards I just um I haven't found any at the Goodwill recently and I just like plum ran out you know so I want to get just like nice plain um like some sort of card stock and do something with that and like create kind of like my own thank you card so that way I'll always have them in stock but anyway let's head out and go to the store all right you guys just got to the post office let's head inside all right you guys just got to the goodwill let's go inside I'm so excited okay you guys I'm gonna go through actually I'm gonna run to the back really quick and see if there's anything new on these carts right here
Oh, how cute is that? Pita Soa, made in Spain. Look at this blue and white stuff. This is super cute. Gallows. From 2002. What are these? Teo? Looks like milk class, Cleveland, Ohio. Attention Goodwill shoppers, just a friendly reminder, color of the week is red. Everything with the red tag is 50% off this week. Thank you for shopping at Goodwill Channel. American Eagle. This platform for delicious. Alright, let's look at the kids' shoes really quick before we head over to the bags. See if there's anything good here. Still looking for something for Zach and Elizo. No, these are all like really worn. What's this? Naturalizer. Oh my gosh, look at this. How cute is this bag? Okay guys, this is so stinking cute. $7.99. It's like an overnight kind of bag. That's so cute. I think like my little cousin would really like this. And it's like an authentic Disney bag. I thought it was like maybe just like a knockoff or something, but it's super cute. It's actually in really great shape too. It's $7.99. I think I might get it. Uh, I was like, it's peeling off. Oh. Just Jessica Simpson bag's been here for a while. I feel like I remember all these bags too. Oh, sometimes they have cute clothes on the rack. Oh my gosh, how cute is that little duck? Dia Neo. What is this? Right here you guys, here's that Pule Cotti bag. It's actually really nice. And the leather feels amazing. I might get it, it's only $7.99. And it's made in Italy and the Safiano is awesome. It just needs a little cleaning. It also has a crossbody strap in there too, which is awesome. All right, and I'm just looking through the rest of these bags over here. Uh, I think I remember all these from yesterday. They still have Dooney here too. The one that I put back yesterday. Is this a Brahmin? No, it's not a Brahmin. Simply Vera. Alright guys, I'm going through the men's shoes. Oh look at these Nikes. Oh, uh, do these like, are these supposed to look like that? That's weird. Okay, that's weird. What are these? Young, fine. Whoa! Look at these Jordans. These are like honestly a little epic looking. I think it's just like the sheer size of them makes them look very impressive. <laughs> Where's the other shoe? The other shoe's not even here. The other shoe is missing. Crikey. What are these? Builder Creek. They look like fry boots, right? 
got some Levi's shoes, some Nikes. These look like they're from the 80s, kind of. Bostonian, some Converse, Adidas, old ones, some New Balance. You guys, my buddy the Panther is still there. Still have that blue and white container. Oh, there's the turkey. All right, you guys know I gotta look at the mugs really quick. Pier one. That is like my kind of design right there. Oh, they have two of those mugs. There's one right there. I only saw one of those yesterday. What are these teapots? These have like macaroons on them. Which is kind of cute. Just looking to see what they have. Oh, Joy Bowl. Target. This is broken. That kind of looks like Pottery Barn, but it's not. Found some Syracuse, China. I kind of like the finish on that, it's really cool looking. Fault scrap. Oh, look at this. Those chickens. California Pantry. Oh, they still have this little Lakers Day thing. It's so cute. I mean, like, if we took photos of it from this angle, it would still be cute, right? The little piece, like, it doesn't connect, so I'm like, can't even glue it back, which is completely unfortunate. So my mom used to be obsessed with Mary Engelbright when we were younger, and these two mugs are so cute. They're 99 cents each. They're literally new in box. So this one says, just for today, be happy. Which is so true. You can make your own decision to be happy. Happiness is your choice, right? It's so cute. I love that it's yellow inside too. This one says, don't look back at your life and no longer an option. So cute. I almost want to get them. Should I get them? Do you guys think the sassy babies are still here? All right, every time I get to this section, I'm like excited and like hopeful because you never know what you're gonna find. Sometimes you can find some really cool stuff. Trina, what's this? Oh, it's like a dirty makeup bag. I like the print though. Here's another one. This one looks like it's like Paper Chase from back like when they used to sell Paper Chase at Borders. But, no, I think it's a 20, a Forever 21 bag. It says 21 on the little thing I'm above her. Wow, what does this say? Valentino Rosen? Goodness gracious. So many things to look at. Okay, they didn't have anything in that little pile of, well, big pile. <gasps> what is this? It's a little Peppa Pig lunch pail. Oh my gosh, is it broken? Oh, it is, like, I feel like it's kind of broken. What's wrong with it? It doesn't want to close. Oh, there it goes, it's closed but it's kind of open. Oh, it's closed. 
How cute! A dollar ninety nine. What is this? A snake print box <gasps> with another snake print box inside. A snake print box nesting box. Wow. Wimpy kid. So this little oh, lunch pail is super cute. Oh, just when I needed thank you cards, they have. Oh wait, what is this? Announcement kit? <gasps> Would it be so funny if I got announcement kit thank you cards? It's a boy. <laughs> They're three ninety nine for fifty cards. Eh, nah. Oh my gosh, you guys, the sassy babies are still here. <gasps> but the sassy grandma is nowhere to be found. But there's a new lady in town. And she is... Is that a sassy geisha? Is that what she is? Okay, what color tags are the babies? <gasps> Stop it! They were a dollar each yesterday and I didn't buy them? Stop. Why didn't I buy them yesterday? What is wrong with me? How come I didn't look to see their prices? Oh, sassy babies. I'm so sorry. Oh, I'm so sad. Ooh, Dumbo. I can't. I am still really sad about the sassy babies, but they have a new matriarch, and she is a sassy geisha. I wish sassy grandma was still here. I'll miss her the most. Oh my gosh, American Girl Crafts Sew and Stuff Kit, just for you. $3.99, I can sew this cute frog. I just noticed that this, so there's a toaster oven down there. <gasps> a topsy-turvy hot pepper plant. Let's look at the other, like, gadgety gadget things. What kind of gadgety gadgets do we have? Crockpot. Keyboards. A power juicer. More crock pots, more printers. Printers. This thing. I totally forgot this aisle and just discovered this like fairy angel. <gasps> a goodie cart. Uh, every time I see this, I like it. Should I get this? Let me know down below in the comments. Okay, so the cart didn't really have anything too exciting, to be honest. Just like these, like, Nike high tops. They actually look pretty new. Does anyone want Nike high tops? How much are these? Mmm, $11.99. Just looking through the shoes really quick. Some Stuart Weissman right there. Got BCBG. These beat up looking Adidas. Huh? <gasps> what does the fuck say? Some Nikes. More Nikes. A lot of Nikes, but no. Oh, if you guys remember that those Nikes that I found yesterday for mom, they fit her. She loves them. So I'm very excited. I'm just going through the rest of these zapatos. Oh, I like the colors on these. Basics. Sam Edelman flats. Look at these holographic babies right here. Those are divided, so those are... What's divided again? Like, Forever 21? No. Um, H&M. Look at these vans. I like... Like, the design on these, but like, the shoes are so dirty. What happened? They're a size eight and a half. They're actually in pretty good condition, like, other than the suede being dirty. Do you guys think we can clean them? Oh, speaking of shoes. Look at these Clark's boots. Are those cute? Or are those like, eh? <gasps> a bench? Eh. 
<laughs> oh my gosh, so why do I kind of want this bench to put in front of the house? I'm just gonna spray paint it black or maybe white and I think it would look fabulous. The only problem is this bench is $45. It's a little pricey. How much do benches cost? Is it worth it? It's so cute. I've wanted a bench for so long. And it's not a bad bench. It's a pretty cute bench. Imagine I could just put some pillows on it. Ooh, I wouldn't put pillows on it in the front though. Maybe if I was just gonna sit there, I'd bring pillows with me. Is that too much? It's cute. I'm looking at the other furniture they have. They have like hutches. Okay, this is literally the funniest pillow I've ever seen. It's a hundred dollar pillow. Oh my gosh, this is so funny. Oh, it's from Circus Circus. It's from Las Vegas. What is this? Oh, you can put this in like an entryway and put baskets in it. And then put shoes. We can totally DIY this, you guys. It's $14.99. Hey okay, guys, I found this Jack Skellington frame and a set of four Pyrex mugs. So I think I'm gonna get these. All right, you guys, so I did end up getting the bag. It's just, it was just so nice. Like, it was made so well and so beautifully, so I had to get it. Oh, I also got the Peppa Pig lunch pail. I got this Jack Skellington frame. It's so cool. Like I, I, I was searching online for another one like it and I couldn't find one anywhere. So I feel like it's kind of rare. And I ended up getting finally some Pyrex. <laughs> so they're in really good condition and I like them because they're blue and white. So they're actually like a navy. I think they're coming up kind of black on camera, but they're navy and white. And I'm going to put these up in the shop right now. I think it's the perfect time to put them up because shipping is free. So, check it out. Again, um, I just wanted to let you guys know that the shop, just go to itshadrian.com. Everything in the shop, it's going to be 10% off for you guys. So just send me like a DM or comment on one of the items and just like say, hey, can you mark it down for us? And I'll go ahead and mark it down. And the shipping is also free from now until June 13. So take advantage of that because shipping is usually pretty expensive via Depop, but I always do everything priority mail. So you'll get it very fast and insured. That's what I like. So um, check it out. Again, it's Hadrian.com. And right now I think we're gonna head, let's head over to Hobby Lobby because I really do want to get those inserts. So let's go. All right, you guys, we just got to Hobby Lobby and I'm super excited to go in there. Um, I just actually looked up a coupon. You guys always have to look up a coupon whenever you go to Hobby Lobby or any places like this because there's always like a 40% coupon or something floating around that you can use on your purchase. And they always have a 40% off coupon at Hobby Lobby. So, gotta get that. And I also saw that like a bunch of home decor stuff right now is 50% off, which is amazing. I can't use the coupon, the 40% off coupon with that but it's like a separate like discount. So now I'm kind of afraid to go inside because I'm gonna see all this home decor stuff and I'm gonna want it. So I'm gonna try and be strong, but I'm still gonna look at that stuff because it's my favorite. So let's head inside the store and see what we can find and try to restrain ourselves from buying everything inside the store. All right, you guys, for Hobby Lobby, let's head inside and check it out. I'm so excited. I haven't been here. I think I haven't been here at all for like, um, maybe I don't think I've been here this entire year. <gasps> home decor, clearance. Select group. Wow. Let's see what's on sale. Oh my gosh, all the flowers are 50% off. Why are you doing this to me, Hobby Lobby? Look at all these beautiful botanicals. These beautiful faux botanicals. An H mug? Oh, this bread thing is so Super cute. So is that weighing scale. Okay guys, literally I want everything including all these llama things. Llama. 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 
Oh, that's not a llama. It's like a, like a wolf. No, like a. Oh wait, this isn't a llama. Is this an alpaca? No, it's a llama. It says llama on there. Llama. <gasps> Another llama. Oh my gosh, you guys, I love this round mirror. This is 119. So this is gonna be. On, don't don't mind my wrinkly shorts either. I've been staying on the floor all day. <laughs> Stop! I love all of these mirrors, actually. But look at this one. Ooh, I love it. This is gonna be 150. Oh my gosh! Look at these little poles. Do they have any geode looking ones, like the ones from Anthropology? That'd be awesome. I see how they have these little marble ones. <gasps> they have like the little, I feel like these are fake leather. That's not that cute. Oh, oh my gosh, you guys. <gasps> oh, they're beautiful. Okay, would it be much to change out like my poles like in my cabinets in my laundry in my laundry room in my bathroom I think I only have two poles how cute would it be to have these on there right and I'm gonna have to see like what kind of poles they are because I honestly don't even remember but like these would be so amazing these amethysts would be like my bathroom would be a little extra but like my bathroom is so small I feel like it needs a little oomph you know and I think that would be perfect. These are so anthropology, you guys. I'm I'm actually kind of dead right now that they have these. They're so cute. I really like this one, and I really like this one, and this one. Those. So cute. Do they have any unicorns? <laughs> Brain always goes to the unicorns. Don't think so. So cool. I think I'm going a little crazy in this store right now because everything is cute. <gasps> Select a group of home decor always 50% off the marked price. So this is 12 <gasps> 50% off of 25. What? I feel like 12 something, 1250. Okay, anyway, the planner stuff is here. Like in this area. So you need to figure out, these are all like the papers. Oh, let me look for paper first, for cards. I just need like some, oh, like see like this card stock is nice, but this is way too large. I could probably just cut these in half if anything, but $5.99, how many of these are in here? 75? <gasps> so I can have like 150 if I cut these in half. Oh, these are like little containers. Oh, cards, oh, cards and envelopes. 12 pieces. This is $20 for 120. Hmm. Oh, I think this is, oh, these are envelopes. Cards and envelopes, $9.99 for a set of 50. Oh my gosh, what if I just sent you guys an envelope that looked like marble? Marble envelopes? <gasps> Confetti? <gasps> Dots? Oh my gosh, gold foil? <gasps> uh, I'm dying. Oh, place cards. For 12? <sighs> so, so expensive. Looking for those goodwill prices, people. Okay, so I've decided that I think I'm going to get this 100 pieces for $5.99 with a coupon. It's going to be 3 bucks. So, I think I'm going to get this guy. Now, let's look for inserts for this. Okay, now I think the inserts are right here. Agenda. These don't look... These look too large. Yeah, these are massive. Uh... Oh my gosh, this is really nice though. Oh you guys, I love these sorts of things so much. And I haven't done any of it in a while because I've just been so super busy. But oh, they have so many new things. These little pineapples are so cute. 
Okay, do any of you guys do planning stuff too? Notebooks, anything like that? Let me know down below in the comments. I used to do these like planner videos or draw with me videos and I know a lot of, not a lot of you guys, but I know a couple of you guys have been asking me about doing them again. Um, like most specifically Vanessa. Vanessa, I do want to do more of these videos. <laughs> but I need to, uh, I feel like I don't think they have any. I feel like these are all too large. You guys, why do I want everything? Okay, I'm gonna be strong. I'm gonna actually leave right now. I couldn't find inserts for the agenda, so I'm just gonna get the paper, which is fine, and get back to the house. Oh no. I love all this sorts of stuff. <gasps> get me away from here. Why am I here looking at this beautiful stuff? Look at these lanterns. Oh, I want all of them. But if I saw any of these at the Goodwill, I'd probably buy them. That one's really cool. This one's cool. That one's cool. That one's cool. That one's cool. That one's cool. They're all super cool. Maybe just not that one because I don't like the thing in the middle. Oh, that is cool. Oh, look at that blue and white um, lamp. Oh, little bird cages. Oh, welcome, Nets. Oh, artwork? Stop. A giant feather? Cows? Ooh, I like those too. Okay, all the llamas are killing me because they're... Oh, choose kindness? I like that. I like that. Do they have any that look like crystals? Crystal artwork. Do I need this unicorn? Oh my gosh, you guys. I need to be strong. I really want to make pillows like this, but I want to use feathers to make the eyelashes be really cool. I want everything. How cute are these little animals? Okay, I'm sorry if you guys are getting kind of dizzy from you like running around frantically, but everything is so cool. I love it all. Okay, I'm gonna close my eyes, put my blinders on, head over to the cash registers. All right, you guys, we are inside my room now, and it was an awesome day. I was just really busy, so unfortunately, I didn't really film too much, but tomorrow, we're going to go thrifting, so I'm super excited to take you guys with me. And today, we did find some really good stuff at the Goodwill, so I'm excited about that. Um, but yeah, thank you guys again so much for watching. Hope you guys had fun, and I'm really oily. I think I'm also kind of sweaty because it's really hot. But... Um, <laughs> <laughs> I'll see you guys tomorrow. I love you guys so much. Don't forget to subscribe, like, check to this, um, check out the thirteen video from this morning, and check out the new thirteen video tomorrow that goes up at seven a.m. Pacific Standard Time, and the new vlog that goes up at two. I love you guys so much. I'll see you guys later. Bye. Okay, let's.